In this video, Mufti Meng was heard saying that shaking a woman can be allowed to an extent. And this video has been trending since it went public. So I got to see this video on TikTok and I entered the comment section to read some of the messages brothers and sisters wrote down. And the messages brothers in Islam were writing cannot be explained because majority of Muslim brothers were against Mufti Meng after watching the video. And very few people acknowledged his personality and gave him the absolute benefit of the doubt. Well, is the video real or fake? Is it actually Mufti Meng who said that? And why did he say that this and many more we will answer today in this video on did you know so stay tuned and don't go far can a woman shake hands with a man under certain circumstances, yes, she can. Okay, I, so I have to be honest with you, I have, I have in the past, I have where I have been, where I have had to, then I have. All right. So if I visited you in Zimbabwe, you will shake my hand. Well, if you extend, if you see my big beard and you extend your hand to me, who knows? I, I may shake it. I, I don't know at the time. I don't because. I, 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 yeah, it's okay. I mean, I'm, I'm not going to make you feel awkward and upset and so on. My brother, don't be a coward. My sister, it is a sign of your own weakness because you are supposed to be so powerful in your mind and your knowledge that you know what I have is so convincing. When I talk to them two times, three times, at least they will acknowledge that we are good people. Even the staunchest non-Muslims who dislike Islam, they will have to nod their heads and say, well done, it's a good religion. I acknowledge you guys have some good teachings. Isn't it about time we did that? So brothers and sisters, that is the video. And as you have heard, the voice sounds like Mufti Meng. That's a confirmed video and audio of him. But what I don't understand is the fact that people are saying bad things about him. And these are bad words that is supposed to come from a brother in Islam. I still believe some people have difficulty understanding the methods Mufti Meng used to teach the deen. He has mastered the habit of using kind and calming tones to draw closer the disbelievers to this beautiful religion of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And it's one of the personalities that actually got a follow on Twitter from Nicki Minaj. And she once were sported wearing a hijab. We know that only Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has the power to make people join Islam because he controls our hearts. But that doesn't mean that when it comes to our relationship with them, we should show them hate. Not believing in somebody's idea does not necessarily guarantee you hate that person. You can disagree to something and still show kindness to that thing. So brothers and sisters, do not get me wrong. I'm not saying that Mufti Meng said the right thing and Islam allows for a guy to shake a woman who is not his wife. Besides, the Prophet وسلم, has made it clear that a person hit in the head with a nail is better than the person shaking a woman's head who is not his wife. So it is what it is, but the hurt is too much. This video was years ago, but people are still ranting. Instead of looking at the mistakes of others, why don't you observe the good in them? and let the judgment be between that fellow and his creator. So yes, my brothers and sisters in Islam, that is what is going on. And I know some of you will have things to say. So let me know what you think about this issue in the comment section down below. And if you are new to this channel, consider subscribing to the channel and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of our content. If you want more people to see this video, consider liking the video as well. With this I say to my brothers and sisters in Islam, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala loves you. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will forgive you and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will guide you. 
so pray to him for he said in the quran uduni astajib lakum assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah wa barakatuh